Conventionally speaking, this is reality. I'm here and I'm real. Am I? We see different things surrounding me and we call this real and also we call this as reality. But when you see this video on Arctube, do you consider that video also as real? In a way, it is. But if you really think respective to time, it is not because it's a recorded version of the video. But for all other practical cases, we can consider that video also as real. How do you sense or feel the environment or the reality? It's using the senses that we have. Usually, it is using our eyes. Are there other realities other than the conventional reality? Yes, these days you get to hear many realities. One is augmented reality or in short AR. In today's video, we are going to look at what is AR. Welcome to another ArcTube What Is. Augmented comes from the noun augmentation. Now the meaning of augmented generally refers to make something big, large or more complete. But the real meaning of augmented reality is to enhance the reality using technologies to overlay a different digital layer or a digital object on top of the real image or the video, usually seen on a mobile device. Take an example, I turn on the camera in my mobile phone and through the mobile phone you can see me and also the surrounding. If the camera resolution is good, you will not feel any difference between what you see on the mobile phone and also you see directly. If my phone has AR capabilities, the AR engine in the phone can actually analyze the environment, analyze the video and also add additional information like the GPS location, maybe use the capabilities like the compass, accelerometer, etc. to enhance the knowledge about the video. Now, the AR engine then can use a communication channel, usually internet, to communicate this information, the video and other information to an AR server somewhere in the internet. The AR server then can push an object, a digital object to the phone so that the digital image or the object is superimposed on top of the real video or in other words it is augmented on top of the real video. Now usually you need to depend on an external server but for very fundamental aspects of augmented reality a mobile phone just can do augmented reality without the help of an external server. If the phone has the capabilities it can locally do these uh, calculations. But whether it is done on the mobile phone or in the external server, still you need to run few complex algorithms to arrive at what you are trying to augment. Let's see how it looks like. I'm using an AR app on my phone. When I turn on the app, it first shows the real environment. I now push a virtual object, in this case Spider-Man, to the real environment. We feel like Spider-Man is actually here. The quality of videos, animations and AR technologies almost makes us to believe that the AR is real. Now you see the Spider-Man is real. Oh, even though it's augmented to the real environment, you see it as real. AR capabilities can be used for many applications. Those include games,
remote surgeries. Machine operations. And also reading the information on grocery items. One of the very famous mobile games using augmented reality is Pokemon Go. In this game, virtual creatures or virtual objects looking like creatures will be augmented in the real environment. Is mobile phone the only device which can be used for AR applications? No. You can use AR glasses and also tabs and other equipment as well. Now, for example, if you use an AR glass for maintenance purposes, suppose you are operating a machine and you want to do certain repairs, you can keep your both hands free because the glasses will show you all the instructions. So that makes your work easy and you can perform the work accurately. I hope now it is clear to you what is AR or augmented reality. So when you want to buy furniture to your living room next time, check with your furniture supplier whether he or she has an AR app and use the AR app to keep the virtual objects, the furniture inside your living room and see for yourself before you buy the furniture. That's it for today and we hope to meet you again with another ArcTube What Is. And of course we will be discussing another aspect of reality, another form of reality. Till then, try augmented reality for yourself, but make sure that you don't mix the reality with the augmented reality. I'm going to take a photograph with Spider-Man. If you like this video and want to see more by ArcTube, make sure you subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button.